Hi, my name is Dylan Gunning, and this is my R2 build. Welcome back everybody. Before we get started, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to the channel so you can follow along with the entire R2-D2 build. Today, we will be 3D printing one of the data panels on R2-D2. I am using the slicing software Ultimaker Cura, followed by using my Anycubic Cryon 3D printer. Now that the file has been transferred onto my memory card, let's get started with the print. The Silk Silver PLA does a really good job allowing you to print items to make them actually look like metal. While it doesn't look like it's a very large print, this print actually took me over 8 hours. The print height of this print, I set it at 0.12 millimeters high. This allowed for incredible detail. After only 8 hours of printing, the data panel is finally ready. Thank you very much for joining me on my adventure of building a life-size R2-D2. I have links in the description below that will get you started on your own life-size R2-D2. Don't forget to give us some love by giving us a good thumbs up and hitting the subscribe button. Thank you.